Hey guys, in this video we're going to check out the Mackey M-Test 1 Cable Tester. This is a useful tool to check whether a bunch of different audio cables are working properly or if they're broken. I ended up getting this tester since I'm making some XLR cables and it helps to test those out, plus I had a few extra cables around to test. The Mackey M-Test 1 can test various cables including quarter inch TRS and TS, MIDI, RCA, XLR, SpeakOn, and 3.5mm. It's also possible to test other cable types that aren't included in these connectors since it has a continuity tester. The continuity tester lights up and makes a beeping sound when there is continuity between both ends. Another thing that's worth mentioning is that the tester will work to test a cable with two different ends. For example, I can test an XLR to TRS cable. When doing this, you need to make sure that the two ends are plugged into opposite sides of the unit. Not only does the M-Test 1 tell us if the pins are connected, they also tell us if they're connected to the wrong pins. We can see this by plugging a cable in partially. Normally we should see the yellow and green lights line up, meaning that pin 1 is connected to pin 1, 2 to 2, and so on. When we connect the cable incorrectly, the contacts in the jack aren't in the right spot, and then we see this crossover effect. We can also get this problem if the cable isn't built properly, such as if we cross the wires in an XLR cable. The Mackey M-Test 1 is powered by a single 9V battery which is not included with the unit. The overall build quality is really good. The Mackey M-Test 1 is all metal construction and seems very durable. Even the knob to switch between the pins appears to be good quality. The lights are also very bright and easy to see. Battery check can tell you if the battery is still good because if it's not, you won't get lights when the cable is connected and you may think the cable is broken. Here's an example of a cable that is broken. This XLR cable has a loose connector, giving us intermittent connection on pin 3 and a flickering on pins 1 and 2. This cable can't be used anymore unless potentially new connectors were put on. In some cases, the damage may not be at the connector and the cable cannot be used anymore. Thanks for checking out this video on the Mackie Cable Tester. If you're interested in getting one for yourself, check out the links in the video description down below. While you're at it, don't forget to give the video a like, subscribe to the channel, and press the bell icon to get notifications whenever a new video is released. You can also check out our social media accounts to stay up to date on all our new content.